Welcome back to the Retro Bowl Alliance League, the Premier League. We are looking at week 7, 8, and 9, week 8, the bye week here for the Marching Ents. And uh, a couple things going on here. Before we go through the bye week, I do really want to look here. Um, I'm going to I'm going to do this. Uh, Alec Wake has, as you can see here, six games, ten tackles. Yeah, he's got a sack, but he has been so poor. Even though I'm trying to figure this out, maybe you guys have an idea. Between him, his stamina being low, but otherwise he's got great strength. And, oops, excuse me, my other def uh, linebacker who's middle of the road the whole way, uh, his stats spectacular uh, by comparison. Had 12 tackles against the Rams. Um, so I'm not sure what does or doesn't constitute a great linebacker as far as the, the statistics here, because these aren't huge differences. I would have guessed that Wake would have been better than he is, but he's continuing to make lots and lots of missed tackles, missing plays, whatnot. So I'm getting rid of him. Uh, I'm going to take a look real quick to see what I have in the linebacker category of free agents. Um, we've got this absolute stud contract. He's looking for $19 million. Let's see if that's even feasible. I'm going to say it's not. It is not, which is unfortunate. Um, the other option for me is going to be here in the roster. Um, let's see, $19 million. Wake is a $10 million, so I have to come up with another nine. Um, I might consider like Dunbar. He's worth six. And Lange is worth three. Um, may make a move that direction to get rid of those guys. GMG uh, asking $21 million and is just not performing very well either. And I did resign him, but six games this year at 26 tackles. But he's played a couple of good games. Going to give him a little bit more time, but I don't know that he's worth the, the, the second contract right now. Um, let me think for a quick moment. So I think what I'm going to do is I am going to start by releasing Wake. I, I, I'm not going to go through what I did with Iron a year ago. This is just not going to work. Um, so he's getting traded immediately. Um, I'm okay with that. He, he's gone. Goodbye, Wake. I'm going to play without him once. I want to see the difference when I play without him. Um, and then I'll consider what I'm going to do before the end of week eight. Um, because I can't really pick anybody else up here. Let me just look at this now. Um, I can't really pick anybody else up. The only other option would be now in order to get that... Um, this guy is, oop, not gray. I'm looking at Ren. Uh, to get this linebacker, I would need 19 million, which means I need, uh, I've got 11, so I need another 8 million. I need to make up 8 million. And I can't do that with any one player on my roster. Um, I could almost get it here, but I would just be shy. I need 8 million in cap space. Not going to get it. Um, man, it's all that close, isn't it? Um, Gamji, man, I'm going to give you another chance, but it's, it's a short leash for you at this point. I'm going to play. I'm just going to play with that. I'd rather have all studs out on the field than somebody who's not. Let's see how it goes. Let's go ahead and play this game. Against the Kangaroos. Um, here we go. Should be a big game. Gamji sacks the quarterback. Okay. That's uh really that's really amazing. Why is it going slow motion already? Dang. I wish it wasn't in slow motion. Alright, here we go. <sighs> no. Is he gonna get by? How did he miss that? Oak and Shield makes those circus catches. I kind of just, you just expect it, don't you? Nice. Got the first down. Got to keep moving. Need to get this score quickly. Man, there's really not, uh, not giving up anything deep. Come on, Tom Bomb. 30 yards, Tom Bombadil. Nice, sir. All right, let's get our two-point and move on. 
All right, we need to we need to really really do well here. Now GMG misses. Get an interception. Who was it? Must have been a no namer. I need to get one of me one of these where we blow by. No. Nope. Oak with a great comeback route. Big three yarder. All right, Oak, show us your wheels, man. You've got 30 in you, don't you? Yes, he does. Booyah! All right, I like where we're going here. Two scores within the first quarter, and they had the ball to start. That's a really good pace. It's a really, really good pace. Wow. What? If I'd have the right play come up, I could have could have even. Let's see if we can get it. Hmm. Don't want to use up all my audibles, that's for sure. Yes. <laughs> nice Tom Bombadil. All this with two seconds, which means. We just used, we just really, really maximized our clock right there. Nice oak. Oh, no, that was Tom Bomb. Sorry. Nice Tom Bomb. Tom Bomb having a heck of a game here to start. That was huge. That time Allen was too slow. Mary, see, they're just determined to score here. They're going to just give it to him. Short of the first, though. Kept him to a short field goal. That's wonderful. Tom Bomb's got another great route. He might be going all the way again. Look at this guy. <laughs> yes, sir. Tom Bombadil showing off today. 60 yards. Man, I like that. I do. I like that a lot. What if we can miraculously get the ball back? Are they going to be a 12-star offense against us now since it's under a minute at the half? Oh, it might be a huge throw. Please, no. Please, no. Thankfully, nothing. But they're just eating up clock on me. All right, Oak, you got a chance to get by? Show us your wheels. Make a miss. Making a miss. Hogan <laughs> Shield, yes. <laughs> He's got dancing feet. Another 60-yard touchdown. Wow. I really like what I'm seeing here. This is fun again. Awesome. Let's see if our defense can do their thing here. Pretty solid today. Oh, look at this. I feel like my theory is proving itself out a, a bit here. Come on, Oak. Get on your horse, man. Get on your Bronco. We're going to be able to make a miss. Oh, I tried. 59 yarder. Job, sir. Ooh. Tried to retch for it and didn't quite get it. Back down to the mighty Oak. Two yarder. After a huge, huge gainer two plays earlier, he deserves that touchdown, doesn't he? What you got here for me, Tom Bomb? Yes. All right, come on, defense. Let's get another three and out. Last recording, I called it a four and out. <laughs> oh, Gamgee, come on, man. Prove yourself. Prove yourself. Man, and Allen misses the tackle even. Please hold him. Yes. That's really big. Used up a lot of my clock, though, to get down the field like they did. Oh, that's right. You get the audibles reset at halftime. I forgot about that. I could have used that other one. Well, not that I really needed to, but could have used it in the last half. I, I, I did forget that. I totally forgot that. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oakenshield, you beast. Come on, man. That could have been a 99-yarder at this rate. Oh, I shouldn't speak too soon. Look at him. Look at him. 74. Love it. Uh, I didn't get the screenshots. Well, I'm recording. I can get that later. What am I 
I don't need to grab that screenshot right now. That was awesome. That was stinking awesome. He earned that. That was all Oak and Shield. Like, he was in a crowd. Oh, man. Show off. Supreme show off. Hey, season Oak and Shield. No, I wanted the ball back so bad. Please, please. Yes. Let's do this. Let's get a great score here. Let's get a great score here. Be smart. Get down the field. Depends on if Open Show gets by here. Nice. Not going to use timeouts quite yet. Man, but did you see how much time? Here we go with that lag. That lag really screws up. I'm noticing, and I did watch my replay last time, I had as many as six seconds run off. Because there must be an amount of time that after the play is down, as far as like how the CPU looks at it or whatever, it's not based on the clock, it's based on like real time. Uh, but yeah, it's based on real time, I think. Anyway, it, it's 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 difficult to, to figure out exactly what it is. But um, anyway, need to get in the score. Needing to get in here. Needing to get in here now. Ooh, I like this better. It's not a great throw. Good catch. We'll get out of bounds because it's lagging like crazy. Man, stop. This is nearly unbearable there we go for some reason that reset it seems to sp seems to have sped it back up yeah that's that's bad i didn't like anything there oka shield's got the route got to make a good throw hold the line hold the line we've got a linebacker coming middle linebacker blitz I'm gonna have to throw it a little earlier than i want come on oak no dang it did you see the reason I didn't get in because of, because of the lag? Oh my goodness, that is so... <sighs> would have been a greatest of great... Not greatest, but it would have been a really great game. Crap. That lag in the clock just keeps running at that speed. Frick. Oh well. Oh well. Stop. No, I didn't throw to him. That's why they're... Let's talk about how great Oakenshield was, not how poor another one, whatever, whatever. Okay. Man, that was so close to great. Here we go. Here's the deadline. It's nice of them to put that up there. All right. I'm going to stop the recording now, and I will be back. So I've done some thinking here, and I'm pretty sure I know what we need to do. So I've come to the conclusion that we need a stud on all of our in all of our defensive positions. Let me show you. Um, this is how important it is. So I'm going to just show you the stats and we're going to start with, for example, we'll go from kind of the top to the bottom. So our defensive back, Hobbit Mary here, who's a veteran, 29 years old, just stacked great, great attributes. Look at his stats. So he had 13 tackles in this last game. Already at 85 for the season. Legolas, 15 tackles. Last game. Pippen, three tackles last game. And then you get to Pharaoh, who has played, did not play very well this last game, but as a whole is decent. And I wonder if that's because he was without a good linebacker. It was without two linebackers in that spot. So he still gets a, a chance here to continue. Sam Wise Gamgee, uh, again, had a great game. We're going to keep an eye on him. Um, but what I want to do here is I want to consider, and Sam Wise has a, a high cost. He's he's a second-year contract, and he needs to start playing like a first-round pick if he wants to stay on the team. So what I'm thinking is, I'm going to show you here what I've got available in the free agency. So in the free agency, I'm really high on Ren, this linebacker, and I think he's not only going to do well, but he's also going to help Allen develop. We're going to see how that works. I need $19 million. Uh, to to pick him up. And in my roster, the only way to make that happen is to... This is the easiest one. I'm going to get rid of the kicker. He's 100%. <laughs> Look at him. Good job, Lange. He had one field goal last year, one field goal the previous year, or this year. And uh, so he's 100% so far. And I believe he even made like the all-pro 
Alliance team or something like that, uh, if I remember right, because he was one for one. Um, so anyway, he got a, he got a ring out of the deal, but we aren't going to use him. He's just the least critical. So he's definitely going to go, and he's going to save me $3 million here. Um, and we get a second round out of it, so that can easily get another kicker if need be down the road. So he is gone, and now I think what has to happen is, well, I know, because we're still... Uh, we're still shy of the, the 19 that we need, um, and we're shy by only, uh, where are we? We got 14, so we're only shy by 5 million. So either Freeman or Dunbar can go. And as I look at this, I use my running back so infrequently, and he's had three uh, rushing attempts, uh, and it has a fumble during one of those rushing attempts. Also has a fumble during a reception. So used him only six times uh, in, in, in the receiving game, and he has a fumble. I uh, don't think I'm going to use him as much as I'm going to use oops, the tight end. So the tight end, I've got only one touchdown, but I've used him in more clinch, clutch situations. He's, he's got the ball more frequently there. So I think, I know, that's the direction I'm going to go, and it kind of falls on if, if Freeman had a better catching and wasn't fumbling as frequent, that would have been a harder choice. But that's going to give me $7 million, so I'm easily going to gain the cap space I need to pick up the stud. And I'm also going to get an additional second round pick. So John Freeman, take a look at his stats real quick so that they can be remembered down the road. But nothing really incredible. Um, he's had two fumbles already in only nine plays that he has the ball in his hand. So that's a bad ratio. So John Freeman, thanks for your time with us. I know it's going to make everybody a little bit sad um, since he was recently signed. Uh, but that's okay. We can we can get everybody's morale back up here fairly easily. So I'm doing this in week eight so that we can get something out of him. John Freeman, also gone. So now you can see we've got a lot of guys with morale somewhat down. We can change that fairly quickly. Um, we're going to bring in, now that we've got plenty of cap space, we've got $21 million available. Caliph Wren. I think he's going to be the stud linebacker we've been looking for. So Caliph Welcome to the team. Excited to see how this goes now. Um, we're going to need to get everybody back to happy. We're going to start with our important ones. The So we've got Faramir up to a full smile. Um, I'm going to do it for everybody because it's not expensive and it's, it's, it, it's worthwhile in my opinion. Dunbar, big old smile, squinty-eyed smile. Tom Bombadil, yes, squinty-eyed smile. So this is the cost of trading somebody away, I'm, I'm realizing, but uh, look at that, Oakenshield, <laughs> he's happy no matter what. Who's on the team, who leaves the team, he's just going to be happy. It's the year of Oakenshield, the season of Oakenshield. All right, so Sam Wise, we're going to... Meet with him as well. Cost one coaching credit. I'm being careful here in case I accidentally tapped the word trade <laughs> is why I'm reading the message. Uh, I wonder if I can meet with him. Yeah, I can. And look at him. That's brilliant. Already squinty-eyed smile. The new guy, uh, Pharaoh Allen, um, close to being a regular. I'm really hopeful that he turns into the stud I want him to be. He's had some really big games. Um, seven, eight, nine tackles, I believe, uh, this season already. So I realize this is a little boring, but, uh, this is, this is what I need to do before I play my next game. Everybody squinty eyed smile. Perfect. Back to great morale, 99%. Still two million under the cap. Gotta love it. Yes, we did sign a wonderful linebacker here with a good attitude. Um, I think we're ready to go. Still a little bitter about my 56 to six. I'm when I go back and watch that and see the clock running at 13 seconds to score, I believe, and ran out of clock because the. I'll have to go back and look. I think that's the scenario. Really disappointing. But anyway, here we go. Go through the bye week, grab some XP. Nice. Gives Alan a chance. 
to increase. Um, so let's just max out his strength. That way we've got one of his attributes all the way maxed out already. Excellent. Excellent. So here we go. Well, we'll take one of those XP that we spent earlier. Put it back in the pocket. Get ready for the punters. I believe they're a pretty talented team. Uh, their defense is for sure. So, uh, strength of schedule has been, uh, was easy weeks one through three. Very difficult four through six. And so far we're split here. All right, let's see what we can do. Suns a running back. This is a solid defense, so I got to keep that in mind. They're going to be playing very tight here. Just bide my time and get that great long ball. I mean, this is this is quintessential old school. Man, why don't I have a go route? Anybody? Just anybody? Shoot. Give me a block. All right, Dunbar. Get that first and out of bounds. Oh, come on. Dive. I mean, slide. Does Tom Bomb or Oakenshield have a chance to get by here? I think there's a chance. Yeah. Don't jump, man. Now you got to outrun him. Couldn't outrun him. I didn't think he needed to jump there. Is he catching the... Oaken Shield bug that he feels he has to show off on every play. Look at <laughs> speaking to show it off. Oh man, he's a four star, folks. Um, I was talking to Aloof a little bit. I think there's a chance through uh, anyway through the comments on YouTube. I think there's a chance that you just need to really monitor your players. Look at that. Like for example, Gamgee's now had two consecutive games with a big sack. And in my opinion, that's those impact plays, you just got to watch carefully uh, what your players are doing. And, and um, even though my uh, Alec um, from from the pre that I just traded away on my other linebacker, even though he had good attributes, it didn't translate. So I think that it just might might need a little extra attention. Gotta, you just got to pay attention, I guess, is what I'm saying to to the actual play of your of your individual stars and, and see see if they're worth keeping or moving on. Man, this is going to be... Come on. Nice job, Tom Bomb. This defense is, is pretty good. I can see that. I think the defensive back on Oakenshield, though, is not quite as good as the one on Tom Bomb. Makes me want to do this kind of stuff and see if he can get by. Oh, he missed. He dove and missed. Unless that was a safety. They kind of got tangled up there. Not sure which one was which. Seeing this clock management, guys? Gals? Come on, goodbye. Oh, man. Beautiful thing. Beautiful thing, Oakenshield. Ran the ball all the way to the 50. Incomplete. Am I the only one that's really, really excited right now? Job Oak. Tom, you got a back shoulder in you. Oh, I could have I could have thrown that one long. Oh, oh no! You can still be running, dude. Tom Bomb got tripped up and we have to see the replay on that to see. He must have just nipped the white line. Apologize to everybody. I, I've watched my own videos back here from time to time, and I, I have this ugly little swallow, and I do that. And so, sorry, it annoys me, so I'm sure it's annoying others out there. I'm aware of it. I just don't know how to stop it. All right. Can Oaken Shield for 15? He's going to have to make a big cut. 
and dive. Yes. Why do I doubt? <laughs> All right. Here we go, defense. Here we go. Jump Tom Bomb. All right. They're under a minute and a half in the half. So that means they're a 12 star offense. If Took wasn't strong enough, who is? Took the thirds got like, this is how it goes. They stopped them. Long field goal. All right, let's do this. 29 seconds. Please don't go to slow motion mode. Ugh, not willing to try it again. I, I kind of like this route enough that I can do a long back shoulder, get down, and then out. Man, need that long route. Nobody's going to get by here. Oh, dang it. Got Dunbar in there. Don't have a kicker, so I've got to make something happen here. Nine seconds. I need to get past the 30 if I want to consider a field goal. I don't want to consider a field goal. Man, this defense is just not going to give up. The big play. Four, three. <sighs> Do I kick the field goal? Oh, they gave it to me. They gave me the route. I just have to make the throw. But this defense has been sticking with my receivers. This is going to require a great throw. And my, my O-line needs to hold. I hope the blitz does not come. Crap. Oh, crap! Dang it! Poop. No. No. And then this. What a turn of events that, that really just sucked the wind out of me. And then Oakenshield brings it back. Oh, if you could have got all three of those guys to miss, man, almost did. Can I get him to break route on this? Not worth trying. Not worth trying. Don't want to throw the pick. Come on, Tom Bomb. Nice. Oh, man. This score could have been so great. Did you see the flip of momentum like that? I mean, to not score on the last play, they go right down and drive in the first drive of the second half. Interception. Man, imagine what this could have been. Give me a block. Give me a block. Nice Dunbar. Sorry, you're getting out of bounds. We're not taking chances on fumbles here. Come on, CPU, catch up. I don't know what you're lagging for right now. No idea. <sighs> Still lagging. <laughs> Splits the defenders and dives for the pylon. Well, the goal line, not the pylon, I guess. The slow motion crap is just well it's crap not gonna scream not gonna scream want to scream not gonna scream Really? Gonna scream. About to scream. for a good play not gonna get it it's gonna require a miracle oh my gosh oh that was me watching the blitz 
going to go in my little hole and cry now. That game was unbelievably promising, and I squandered it. As much as I played well in the last three-game series, that was that was bad. That was really bad, and I'm going to take all of the credit on it. Of course, they give him... Okay, he did. I feel like when I had great games by other players, they were like, well, didn't the tight end play poorly? Sorry, fans. Sorry, everybody. So there you go. My new linebacker with five tackles. Allen with eight. That's. I think that's a good thing that's happening there. And he's already going to be maxed out. Okay. If I sound subdued, it's because I feel subdued right now. That was. That was not. The defense played pretty good. I mean, we gave up. Uh, two touchdowns that I think were, which really sucked. But uh, I missed the long ball. I missed the long ball at the end that could have led to a possible chance at a score at the very end, and uh, and I didn't score before half. Like two really big. Hmm. That's it. From here, we're gonna keep on marching. You keep marching. Peace.